Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I've just been and done an Audi haul, so I thought I'd show you what I've got. I spent £52 and if you have a look here on the table, that's actually quite a lot. <laughs> I did plan to spend £40, but who am I kidding? I'm not going to spend £40 on a weekly shop. As always, we do have bits and pieces in the cupboard and the freezer and we're also getting a takeout this weekend so if it looks a little bit like what you're going to be eating that's why anyway let's start off over here you just got the king's meal 50 50 bread i'm going to be making a lasagna this weekend so i've got the red sauce and the white sauce a couple of um potatoes there Frozen section, we've got some potato wedges, a deep pan meat feast pizza, some sweet corn. Um, if you've seen my other videos, you'll note that I was doing Sainsbury's online orders for a while, especially during when um, COVID was really high. I was trying to get some online orders. And this is just to give you an example of how much cheaper Aldi is. So this King's Mill bread was 85p in Aldi. And in Sainsbury's, when it's on offer, it's a pound. This deep pan pizza is eight, uh, 89p. Less than a pound anyway. And a similar pizza from Sainsbury's is pound fifty. So I know it's only slight bits, but you know, if everything's like a couple of pence cheaper, then it definitely all adds up. When I done Sainsbury's hauls, I definitely didn't get this much for the amount of money. This would have been about seventy pounds. Anyway, so these are the wedges. If you haven't tried these before from Aldi, I really recommend them. It was quite funny. About a year ago, I was in Aldi, and my man from Domino's was um, queuing up in front of me because he had the Domino's um, uniform on, and he was buying these these wedges, and he had about twenty packs. So I reckon this is what Domino's use, or they definitely use that time anyway. Uh, chorizo, which is the basic garlic baguette. You can't go wrong with these ones really. Some sausages, mince for the lasagna, mushrooms, some um, washing detergent, some dark soy sauce, some smoked paprika, some lighter mutual cheddar, some uh, antibacterial wipes, hummus for the husband's lunches, salted butter, wonky blueberries, but again, I don't see what makes them wonky, they look fine to me. I don't know it's reflecting there, sorry. British um, chicken breast fillets. I thought they would look quite big actually. And that was just under four pounds. So not bad for the amount you get. Some broccoli, some mixed peppers. I couldn't find any that had more yellow and orange peppers in them. They just had the green, which is slightly annoying, but I'll hide them in the lasagna. Some carrots. Two lots of these snacking roast chicken bites. My little one likes these, but they're quite handy to have. Some golden savoury rice. Um, this is just handy to have in the cupboard. It's only 29p and it's really nice. Some pop tarts as their special buys for 1.99. Again, Sainsbury's sell these for £2.75 on full price. A couple of bat, um, boxes. My little one hasn't tried these, so I thought I'd give it a go biscotti and strawberry the milks I've got semi skimmed and then the whole milks behind there a classic barbecue sauce I'm going to be making a hunter's chicken this week um, so that's what that's for some matchmakers some jammy wheels which you might be it says I'm new here they're like the um, jammy dodgers it's just so funny the packaging because it's literally exactly the same as the the actual branding. So I don't, you know, I, I would get annoyed if I if I was a brand and people were copying my exact logos and stuff. But hey ho, some milk chocolate buttons, 
some strawberry laces. We're meeting up with some friends for a little gathering, so we've just got some sweet treats for that. Pack of 18 um, cans of Dr Pepper for £5.50 under their special buys. I thought that was really good going. Normally I pay about £3 for six or eight, so that's really good. We'll just keep them in the fridge as we've got an extra drinks fridge, and that's always handy. Some confection roast chicken in time, so these are meant to be like the sensation ones, but they're really nice. I think these were 80p. And my husband actually prefers these to the sensations. So there you go. A couple of bananas, well, five bananas. We've got some jumbo pack of nappies. I only get my daughter's nappies from Aldi. I really rate them. They're very good price and just good quality. Some eggs. I went to get a pack of 12, but they didn't have any. And we have still got some in the fridge. Do you keep your eggs in the fridge or outside in a little egg cage? Let me know. I know some say, oh, don't put them in the fridge or others say, oh, you can't leave them outside. You've got to put them in the fridge. So what's the best thing to do? Some lemons, a pack of six lemonades. Again, this looks exactly like Schweppes. And uh, this was £1.19 for six cans. I just can't believe it's crazy prices some wholemeal pitters and some London cheese cakes. My mum likes these, so I got them for her, as you can't seem to get them in other um, supermarkets. Anyway, this is everything that I got. Please let me know, have you been shopping at Aldi? Have you seen the difference in costs? Let me know in the comments. Um, if you like videos like this, then please do hit that subscribe button. Check out my other videos. I've got loads of other food hauls and please do take care and stay safe and until the next time, bye.